Trending right now, accused sex offender Bill Cosby, a motivational speaker, fresh off a mistrial on an indecent assault charge. As Cosby says, his spokesman is about to hit the speaking circuit to talk about sexual assault. Now, as you might imagine, the plans have both legal and public relations experts basically shaking their heads. And wondering whether uh, the talks will actually happen. Our Bruce Gordon, of course, covered Cosby's first trial from beginning to end. He joins us in studio. Bruce, this is surprising. Yeah, to say the least. It seems to an awful lot of folks like Cosby taking a victory lap of sorts after a tie game, one he came awfully close to losing, and one that is soon to be replayed. The stunning plans were revealed by spokespersons for Bill Cosby and his wife Camille on a morning TV show in Birmingham, Alabama. I think we move on now. Mr. Cosby wants to get back to work. We are now planning uh, town halls. The subject of those town halls? Apparently accusations of sexual assault. This issue can affect any young person, especially young athletes of today. Uh, and they need to know what they're facing uh, when, they're, when they're hanging out and partying, uh, when they're doing certain things that they shouldn't be doing. And it also affects, you know, married men. This is why people need to be educated on a, a brush against a shoulder. You know, anything at this point can be considered sexual assault. It's very, uh, it's a good thing to be educated about the law. I think it's incredibly risky. I see no upside. I see nothing but downsides. William Brennan is a veteran criminal defense attorney and a friend of Cosby lawyer Brian McMonagle. I assure you that uh, this is not uh, coming from uh, his advice. Uh, this is an open matter. This matter will be retried, as the DA said, and any public statements the defendant makes could come back to haunt him. It's not clear exactly what Cosby would talk about or how or if he would describe his experience as an accused sex offender. But a public relations executive we spoke to poured cold water on any thought of Cosby repairing his image from a town hall stage. I don't know who told Bill Cosby, if it was his spokesperson, his wife, or whomever, that he won, but he's getting bad advice or he's getting bad information. He did not win. He is guilty in the court of public opinion, and we don't know in the court of law if he's innocent or guilty, and it's still yet to be determined. If you're advising him, <laughs> what, what do you say about the speaking to her? Uh, sit down, shut up, and don't come out of your house. One Cosby trial juror says they were 10-2 in favor of conviction on two of the three indecent assault charges. Another juror claims the final vote was a little closer than that. I reached out to Brian McMonagall for comment on these town hall plans. I've not heard back from it, him. It's just really all rather stunning. Well, we'll see whether this stuff actually happens. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah good it. point. All, all right. right, Bruce, thanks.